First of all, I am welcoming you to the YouTube channel Enjoy Music with Smithas. In fact, I had forgotten to record a clip expressing my deepest thanks for your overwhelming support, the beautiful comments and huge likes to the videos. Basically, we are here for your support. On behalf of Enjoy Music with Smithas, I solemnly dedicate all the success and the growth of this channel to you people who are supporting like anything. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for your support once again and many times expressing our deepest gratitude for all those great actions by you. See, I, I had told you about the Lord Krishna's saying in Bhagavad Gita. See, you, if you if you don't think about the result, you, you you may be thinking just listening to this particular fact that what this man is trying to convey. See, my point is that if you if you do not focus on how to achieve, if you do not have a planning to achieve your aspirations, dreams, or goals, so it's very difficult. You cannot. Exhort the hard work, the amount, the quantity of effort we, you, you need to pour into so that you can achieve the goal and the time deadline. This is, this is absolutely true. But what Lord Krishna is trying to say here is deeply thinking of the result only and we forget the hard work the right direction the time deadline we forget all these things and we start becoming crazy about the result so the winner is is not a crazy man about the winning aspect rather the winner is a strong planner and then the planning is executed with basing a lot of hard work with the right direction and the time bound issues which you can understand. So these things are basically explained in management theories. You have your business management and business administration courses in which you go through all these things. Planning and strategy are very important. So through planning and strategy, developing a certain, a particular strategy hmm, with the proper guidance from an instructor, a trainer, you start achieving the goal. But I'm, I'm talking of the individual aspect here. I'm not extending it to a broader community, a, a company, or organization. I'm just talking about an individual aspect the only thing is that so we need to go on throwing our best possible hard work to achieve the goal with the right direction and with the time deadline these things may be sounding impossible thing but this is not like that people who have won a lot of things you can you can have an interview with them. You can read books and biographies of those guys. How they had won everything in their life. You need to face challenges. You need to go. You need to stretch your limits, your constraints. You need to expand your life. So here, here comes the key factor. One is the prayer. See, prayer is the biggest possible affirmation what I believe on this planet. Huh? You, you would have heard about that. The more the affirmations, the stronger the affirmations, the more quickly you are going to realize your dreams, your aspirations. That is true. Because our mind starts believing once we are into strong affirmations or very positive thinking. 
everybody says develop positive thinking because of this that our mind starts believing that yes it is happening it is there with me yes i am rich i am not poor yes and i am going to earn a good amount of money within one month so the more deeper the formations are so the quicker the result but these things are, are not superficial artificially these things cannot be generated so in order to generate there's a very fundamental and common thing you people can understand that in any religion prayer is very very fundamental and essential everywhere all over the world whatever the communities and whatever the sex whatever may be the religion prayer is a very very the core part of the practice of the faith so because prayer is the biggest affirmation the develop sort of spells the develop sort of phrases to uh, enchant to repeat those things but that is a technical method to uplift the affirmations the level of affirmations it's not easy task to just simply superficially thinking yes i'm rich i'm not a poor man yes everything is good i'm successful in youtube and i'm successful in my endeavors it's easy to think but the real core inside your heart you will be knowing that whether you are really a rich man or poor man even if you are not a rich man i am citing one example even if you are not a rich man if you start thinking yes i am rich that is not going to help you believe me so believing that you are rich is something very deeper so when you develop such thing within your own self that's what i in the earlier part of this video i explain about developing an introspection speculating inside but developing an inner vision so such things such affirmations that yes you are rich even if you are not rich actually it's not possible with some easy tasks like this ha huh? we can develop a thinking positive thinking but to channelize such things to channelize our, the energy of our mind hmm? suppose we are pouring we are trying to achieve something so we need to we are taking actions we are taking lot of thought process and we are taking lot of uh, even we are interacting with uh, speech and lot of things we are doing but but the same time simultaneously there is an invisible force which is moving parallel to all these things and that invisible force is really the determining factor of our success and that cannot be artificial so that so people had laid uh, from the uh, ancient time till yet the man had learned the civilization so till this moment in all the community in all the sex faith uh, faith is very important and faith after that faith is based on a strong prayers prayers will help us to take right action and the time deadline will understand the time deadline there will be no wastes of energy in the in the last video i had already talked about how do we develop thinking in the whole stretch of the day we we, we go on thinking of such vague things which are really not going to contribute our growth we go on thinking of wasteful things so rather than thinking such things we can develop a sort of thinking which can really contribute to our inner growth and the more we are stronger in the inner sight the more things will be reflected in our surroundings 
the same thing will be reflected in our surrounding so we need to develop that point which is there inside us and is not we are not able to see that <clears throat> so these things will be taken care of automatically when we start praying even if it is artificial we start developing a habit hmm? and then and then uh, with the instruction of a trainer so here the best possible technique the term spiritual term is a mentor with the guidance of a mentor we start developing a habit of prayer gradually we develop slowly slowly we develop the real sense of praying and believing and strengthening our affirmations to the highest possible in order to achieve every goal 